Hello guys, this is YouTube channel Path and Lighter and this video is regarding APFC paper. This is detailed solution with explanation. This is from question number 1 to question number 30. This is part 1 of the series and presented by me Deepak Jaiswal. Before starting with, let me clear your doubts regarding how the marks will be calculated. The first doubt that is the total marks are of 120 questions, how it will be converted into 100. So suppose you have got 98, suppose you have done 98 questions. 92 are right, 6 are wrong. Then you will get 92 minus 6 wrong to so 6 into 0.33 that is 2. This means you will get 90 out of 20. This 90 out of 120 will be converted into percentage. This will come 75%. So you will get out of 100 when this will be converted into 100. You will get 75 marks. Now the second query that what will be the cutoff? According to me, it will range between 68 to 73. This will be the cutoff for general. Now coming to the questions. Land, man, van. Land is local area network. Man is metro, metropolitan. And wide is wide area. W is wide area network. So the answer for that will be C. For this, length is equal to twice width. So this becomes twice width. And this becomes width. So width, twice width, width, twice width. So when we will solve this comes 6 w equal to 360 so w will become 360 by 6 that is 60 and length is since 2 w so 16 to 2 that is 120 so the answer here will be a 120 now cloud computing cloud computing the option will be c and the c is a distributed computer architecture that provides software infrastructure and platform just as required by application or user now coming to nanotechnology Nanotechnology is atom by atom, so 1 is correct. 2. Physical property change at the nanometer scale, yeah this is also correct. Second and third chemical property changes at the nanometer scale, no it is not so. So the answer here will be A, that is 1 and 2 is only correct. The project LHC and CERN is located between France and Switzerland, that is the correct answer is here D. Now method of communication in which transmission can take place in both directions but happen only in one direction. The correct answer is B half duplex. You can google it and you can find, find it in Wikipedia that the method of communication in which transmission takes place in both directions but happens in only one direction at a time is half duplex. Now coming to collection of programs that control how the computer system runs and process info is B operating system. Now SMPS, SMPS is switch mode power supply that is C, USB is universal source bus that is C, chess tournament each of 6 players will with every other played exactly once, number of matches played will be, answer will be B15 and how let me show you, suppose there are players 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, so this 6 will play with all the 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then this 5 will play with 4. 4, 3, 2, 1. This 4 will 1, 2, 3. This 3 will 3, 2, 1, 2, 1. And this 2 will 2. So 5, 4, 3, plus 2, plus 1. This becomes 15. So the answer will be 15. Now maternity benefit tax provides for 12 weeks of wages during maternity. Instruments providing social security in India. <coughs> Sorry out of 6 months and days, EPF, LIC, NPS and Postal Provident Fund. That is the answer will be C, 2, 4, 5 and 6. Now instrument providing social security in India. This is for maternity benefit is 12 weeks that is B and for instrument providing social security in India is C. That is 2, 4, 5 and 6. Now a man buys apples cost price equal to X per dozen. This means x upon 12 is the cost price of 1, 8x upon 100 is the cost price of selling price of 1. So selling price minus cost price we will get minus 0 0.04. So when we solve it, it we will get 4% of loss. So answer will be C that is 4% loss. When we will when we'll, a minus selling price minus cost price, this cost price is x by 12, selling price is 8x by 100. We minus 8x by 100 minus x by 12, we will get minus 0 0.04. When we will convert it into percentage, we will get 
the four quantities am is equal to am of first three quantities then what will be the fourth quantity the answer in this is this is question number 15 the answer in is the b that is am of first three quantities b now let me show show you how suppose we take example 10 12 14 and 16 14 suppose this is the first three number okay now its average mean will, will come 12 so the number we will have we will have to add so that if it becomes 12 then this 3 will become 4 and then again we will get the arithmetic mean as 12 only so this means we have to add arithmetic mean of first three digit to get the same arithmetic mean so the fourth quantity will be arithmetic mean of the first three quantity that is b now in this question 1970 1970 the population is 40000 Okay, in 1980 it is 50,000. So 1970 to 1980 population is 10,000 increase. 1990 to 2000 the population is 12,000. 80 to 90 then again 10,000. Then 2000 to 2010 it is again 8,000. When we will convert it into percentage, we will find that the answer it will be B. 1980 to 1990 and 1990 to 2000 is the rise percentage rise of population is C. Now, difference of two numbers is greater than sum of the numbers. Difference of two numbers is greater than the sum of the numbers. In this, according to me, the answer will be A. That is, both the numbers should have to be negative. Why? Suppose we have taken minus three minus two. Okay. So minus three minus two. When this will difference of two numbers, then this becomes plus two. Minus minus plus. This becomes minus one. This will be greater than. Sum of the number that is sum of the number it will be minus three minus two that will be minus five. This is two. Suppose if we take at least one negative number, at least one negative number. Suppose this we take minus two, and this we take plus three that is this becomes minus three. This becomes five, minus five, and this will become greater than two uh, minus three. This becomes three minus two. That is, it will become greater than one. This is wrong. So, for this to be true, I think the question number, the option A will be correct. That is, both the numbers should be negative. Both the numbers should be negative. Mind it, this is both the numbers should be negative, not at least one, but both the number has to be negative so that this e equation can become true. Now, palindrome between ten and one zero one zero. This is simple question, but bit, little bit lengthy so that. Uh, it get repeated that means 1 1 2 2 11 22 33 44 so this will come 9 then again from 1 0 1 1 1 1 1 2 it will become 10 so from 100 to 1000 it comes 10 into 9 that is 90 from 1 to from 10 to 100 it comes 9 there are 9 numbers as such and 1 0 1 0 Between one zero zero to one 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 zero one zero, there is only one number that is one zero zero one. So ninety plus nine plus one that is hundred. So total hundred palindromes will be there. Now coming to number of one used in writing digits from one to three hundred. In this, similarly, the question in the we have solved it in previous way. In this also, there will be the answer will be here will be one sixty. And how we will solve it? We will do it accordingly that. We will write starting from one, ten, eleven, twelve. So we will count it from this. That is from one to ten, it's two digit. From eleven to nineteen, it's nine. Then from twenty-one, thirty-one, forty-one, and so on. So when we all calculate it, we will get total with number of digit. Total one digit used is one sixty number of times. Now for calculating arithmetic average of twenty-seven to ninety-three. It is simple. First of all, we will calculate 1 to 93 by using the formula n n plus 1 upon 2. Then we will calculate 1 to 26. Then minus 93 minus 1 1 to 93 sum of 1 to 93 and minus sum of 1 to 26. Then we will find it the 
the arithmetic uh, we will get certain digit and when we will divide it by the total number of digits from 27 to 93 that is 67 we will get the answer at d60 now atal pension yojana this is basically the answer will here we see that is it beneficiary must be in the age group of 18 to 40 years beneficiary will receive the pension only after he attains the age of 60 years and after the death of beneficiary his spouse continues to receive the pension so answer here will be c then if he is a member of Raj Sabha, then answer here will be D that he will not be able to vote in the in his favor in the event of no, no confidence motion. Why? Because no confidence motion will always happen in Lok Sabha. And since he is a member of Raj Sabha, he cannot vote it in Lok Sabha. Now the Malimat Committee, sorry, the second uh, 22nd is which one of the following basic premise for developing Indian constitution. We have already done it in the lecture that is answer will be A Government of India Act 1935. Now Malimat Committee, the option is B that is criminal justice system in India. Now this advantages of prudent fund, the answer here will be A that is money is inadequate for this occurring early in working life and second inflation erodes the real value of savings. Now in genetically engineered crops, engineered crops, I have uh, studied it in vast I have uh, find out that the answer here will be C that is 1, 2 and 4 only. I, I didn't find any mention of growing this genetically engineered crops in spaceships or space stations. So its purpose is to enable them to with, withstand drought that is 1 is correct. To increase the nutritive value of the project 2 is also correct and to increase their self life 4th is also correct. So the answer here will be C 1, 2 and 4. Now coming to GNP, GNP is, GNP is all, domestic, all products plus remittances received from abroad minus remittances sent abroad. So the answer here will be 1, 2, 3 because there is nothing mentioned that income is sent to abroad. There is mention, there is mention of net income from abroad in the fourth point. So this is included in GNP. So the answer here will be 1, 2, 3 and 4 that is D. Now coming to theory of distribution. The theory of distribution is the distribution of income between the owners of factor resources. That is D option is correct. Demand for a factor of production is said to be derived demand because demand of factor of production is said to be derived demand because the second in this second and fourth is correct. So the answer is C that is demand depends on the supply of complementary factors. 2 and 4 is it arises of the mean being means being it arises out of means being scarce in relation to wants and this is third is also right in this that is it stems from the demand of the final product so 2 3 and 4 in this 2 3 and 4 is given only this uh, in D 1, 2, 3 and 4 so the answer here will be 1, 2, 3 and 4 that is the answer here will be D that it is a function of the profitability of enterprise it de determines on the supply of complementary factors it stems from the demand for the final product and it arises of out of means being scarce in relation to want now in free trade area in free trade area the answer here will be D that is when ever countries set up a free trade area, they abolish all restrictions on trade among themselves and each country maintains its own set of tariffs and quotas on imports from outside countries. So the answer here will be D. Now coming to FIPB. In this FIPB, 1, 2 and 3 are correct. Fourth is not correct. Reason being FIPC does not come as, comes under Ministry of Industry. So the answer will be 1, 2 and 3 only that is A. This FIPC does not come under Ministry of Industry. So this is all it. Thank you.